Hey everyone and welcome back to Be Terrific. We are live here from Toy Fair 2016 at the Jacob Javits Center in New York City. I'm Andrea Fasano. And you know, here at Toy Fair, there's a lot of talk about STEM products and products that meet the STEM requirements. Right now we have a product from Kinex and this is Kristen. Kristen, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much for having me. Yeah, I'm excited to learn more about this fun product. And uh, I mean, it's very interactive right yes. here. This yes. is so cute. This is Mighty Makers. Mighty it's our Makers. new line of STEM engineering building sets for girls. Excellent. It's for girls seven and up. Um, basically, we're trying to get them interested in the world around them, mm -hmm. to make them naturally curious about STEM products. So they go through, in this set specifically, the fun on the Ferris wheel, they build the Ferris wheel, and then they get a little Mighty Maker concept card, and on the back it teaches them about gearing, so how to make the Ferris wheel oh. go faster or slower based on where the gears are. So it's all about engineering principles. Excellent, and look how cute that card is. Yes, and then this is the figure. This is Emily. She's Aww. the Mighty Maker from the set. She's our little engineer. We have a marine biologist, an aviator, so the girls build anything they can imagine and then they learn about the STEM content behind the sets. How great is that? Yeah. I feel like that'd be so fun to have when I was a kid. Yeah, you know, right? It's really hands-on. Mm -hmm. um, re really just you get confidence from building it and yes. doing it yourself. Yep. I like that. And you explained something about the gears back here? Yeah, if you, so the Ferris wheel's going one speed now, but if you switch the gears, it would actually go a little bit slower because the larger gear would be on the bottom. And so that ex is explained to the yes. child in the car. Yep. Wow, how fun. Yeah. That's pretty incredible. Yep. Yeah, so we've seen that, you know, by the time girls get to middle school, they kind of lose interest in, l lose interest in STEM principles. Right. You know, they're not as into math or engineering or science, and I think that's because they need to be into those kind of toys earlier. So yes. this is for girls seven plus. You know, they're still in elementary school. We just want to teach them that science and building things with their hands is fun. You know, there's a lot of girls that are already doing that. Mm -hmm. We just want more girls more, to be doing that. Absolutely, and I think it's also something to be said, like you just explained, um, to the fact that there isn't anything to immerse them in. There right. isn't anything to apply those subjects right. of math and science and that kind of right. thing at a certain age unless you're in it from the get-go. Right. So doing something fun like this at home where you're playing. Exactly. And you're just building something to be That's aesthetically yes. pleasing and you're also yep. learning in the process, right? That's exactly the point. You know, they get such a sense of accomplishment just from building the Ferris wheel. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, they want to learn all about Emily. They want to be like Emily. And then they uh, learn all about the engineering concepts behind it. So they don't even know that they're learning. So you mentioned the other, like the marine biology. Yes. What does that consist so of? So that one has a boat and it comes with Marissa. Marissa, oh, she's a cute. marine biologist. She has a little fish named Queenie. Oh, so adorable. you build her boat and then um, it teaches about the uh, food chain. So you build like a little shrimp and like and a turtle, <laughs> and she build she builds the entire food chain, and then learns about that with the set that as well. That is so cute. Yeah. And then what's the other one? There's an aviation one um, with Ava. She looks a little bit like Amelia Earhart. Cute. So you build was, a, a plane. Of course, that's what I thought of. And some other flying contraptions. Um, one of the newer sets we have this year is called the Director's Cut. Okay. So she actually can use, she builds a stage and then she can build a stand to put her uh, iPhone or Android device on, film a little video, then you rebuild the stage into a theater and she can screen her movie. What? Yeah, it's pretty cool. I feel like that's for guys and girls. Yeah. That's amazing. Absolutely. Yeah. I want that. <laughs> I want I that like now on this it's stage. Awesome. <laughs> it's really cool too because you build a little rig with it where yeah. you can do like zooms and pans. So that's what the content is in that. It's learning about all the different camera movements. I think that's amazing. Yeah. I mean, so many kids these days are with their iPods and their um, right. phones. Right, right. That they have access to. Maybe it's not used for cellular data or right. cell phone, but they're using it, taking right. pictures. I have little yep. cousin, she's five years old taking photos, uh, manipulating the photos. So they know things. Oh, absolutely. Kids know things so Two-year-olds can like swipe through yes, an iPhone. Yes, it's amazing. Yeah. 
So that sounds like such a cool toy. Yeah. I'm going to have to get that. Yes. <laughs> Are they all for sale right now? Um, this one is for sale right now. The director's cut will be available in fall of this year. So oh, okay. around June or July. Good to know. Yeah. And where can somebody buy this? Or uh, these Mighty Maker products by Kinex? Yes. They're available at retailers nationwide. Okay. You can find them at Toys R Us, uh, Amazon.com, Walmart.com, Target.com. Pretty much anywhere you would shop for toys, you can find Mighty Makers on the shelf. Excellent. <laughs> and where did the Mighty Makers concept kind of come from for Connects? Um, you know, we we know that there's girls building with Connects, and especially over the past five years, we've seen more and more girls building with them, and we wanted to try to figure out why more girls weren't building with them. Because Connects is such an old company. Yeah, it's uh, we'll be 25 next year. Amazing. So, yeah. A lot of anniversaries <laughs> for toy companies coming yes. up. Yeah, definitely. So um, we had some focus groups. We asked girls, um, what do you want to build? And their answers were surprising. It was similar to what boys want to build, cars, mm -hmm. airplanes. But we found um, when we put parts in front of them, we put regular colored connects and then we put them um, more pink colored, pink and purple, not like overly girly. Right. Uh, we put a bin of those parts and every girl in the focus group went right to those parts. For the bright colors. Yes, because they felt like that was for them. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of them in the focus group would answer and say, oh, I play with Connects, but I play with my brother's Connects. And they really wanted a line that was specifically for them. For, yeah. So they could tell their brother, no, you can't play with these. These are my, right. these are my Connects. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so cool. I love this. And so do, do they stick on here? Yeah, the figures, um, this one's a prototype, so I'm oh, not okay. going to put her on there. Right, but, no problem. But normally they would. And you can put the, the little bear. The can go on yep. there. Oh, look at you the teddy bear. You can stick him right, right in the Ferris uh, wheel. He has a removable uh, wind up. And they all work together. So How cute. You get this set, get, you get the other sets, you just have more and parts you and you can build bigger things with that's them. That's amazing, they could just do it on their own. Yeah, yep. Really smart. Yeah, they, they, come with, they do come with instruction books, so there's usually two to three models per set that they can build right from the book. Okay. But then, once they get the hang of the building principles, they can do whatever they want. And do you know how much this is about? Um, this set is about twenty nine ninety nine. Okay. Yeah. That's great. I feel like that's a really decent price yeah. point for something. Yeah. And the whole line, it starts at about eight ninety nine, and it goes all the way up to about $50. Awesome. So. All right, Kristen, thank you so much. Thank you. That's Kristen from Kinex. So much more coming up from Toy Fair 2016 right here. Stay tuned to Be Terrific and to ToyFairNY.com. I'm Andrea Fasano. We'll be right back after this.